It's not hard to notice a change. The San Francisco Standard captured this encampment on Van Ness Avenue and Eddy Street two months ago. This week, a completely different look. Planter boxes now on the sidewalk, this a mile from APEC. Mina Street between 7th and Julia Streets with multiple tents two months ago. This week cleared, less than a mile from APEC. All this leading to the question, where did San Francisco's homeless population go? We found many of them on Willow Street. Where were you before being here on Willow? Uh, Harrison and 5th Street, down the way a bit. Before APEC, Cody had set camp two blocks from Moscone Center. For the last week, U.S. Secret Service has been restricting access to a 12-square block radius in the Soma neighborhood for the summit. Cody said city workers showed up and offered him shelter. He took it. So did the city move you? Uh, yeah, pretty much. You know, I mean, they tell you they'll block off certain streets and stuff and have tell you to keep going. St. Anthony's has been keeping track of the need for shelter in the Tenderloin. It has seen an uptake this week. So a month ahead of APEC, what did you guys notice? Uh, approximately about a month before APEC began, there was an uh, intentional uh, engagement with the city and uh, homeless, uh, people experiencing homelessness in South of Market. In a statement, San Francisco's Department of Homelessness acknowledged that when events like APEC take place, efforts change, saying, quote, we want to put our best foot forward. Dedicated outreach efforts will be focused on the conference vicinity and offering safe places for people experiencing homelessness will be priority. That many of the folks who are, who are staying south of Market on the street have been asked to relocate. And many of those people who were asked to relocate were offered shelter. Businesses in the Tenderloin are glad more homeless individuals are now in shelters, but are concerned of what will happen once APEC is over. So you're going to keep pushing for this? We're definitely going to keep uh, pushing. We're all the constituents, the property owners, the businesses. We are the mayor's constituents. We are the city of San Francisco, um, and they need to listen to us. And San Francisco's Homelessness Department said that even though there was no special shelter capacity for APEC, the city did open winter shelter on the same day APEC started in San Francisco, adding about 300 beds to the shelter system.